What's up, guys? It's Kim Chang. And Tofu. Yeah, yeah, Dr. Stone time. Yeah, Dr. Stone. It's time to learn and research. And get into the war. War or like Plotting, new... Plotting, no, spies. The, the spies, yeah, I think we're not going to be seeing them for a while, but we're going to be seeing new characters, which is Kohaku, and we're going to be finding new stuff about this village mm -hmm. that's born after this stone world. And yeah, Senku's going to be the one to discover it. It's going to get exciting. We're doing two episodes today, guys, for episode seven and number eight. Catching up, so next week, we're on time. Heck yeah. Yes, and all the weekly ones, such as uh, Hunter and Kuroko, will resume tomorrow as a back to the normal schedule. So Monday to Friday, and then of course the weekends are the ongoing animes. Yeah. Yeah, so guys, thank you guys so much. Are you guys ready? Yeah, let's go and watch Dr. Stone. <laughs> yeah, let's go watch. <laughs> Oh yeah, that's right. She's taking a quite a liking in yeah. Mr. Stone or Dr. Stone. <laughs> this guy don't like it. and <laughs> She's already in love. <laughs> Look at his face. He's grossed out. He looks so up. disgusted, right? <laughs> yeah. He's not really much of a relationship person. But watch, she's going to make him a relationship person. Oh, sh look at the way she Yeah, she sleeps always on guard. <laughs> oh, she's protecting herself from him. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> he has a foul mouth, but he looks like a gentleman. Yep. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, yeah, he just woke up from the dead. He doesn't want to do that again. Oh, she's going to help take out Tsukasa. And she has the allies, Ooh, the village. Yeah, the manpower. Oh, we're going to be seeing the whole village this episode. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh wow. Whoa. Nice. We're going to be seeing some new, a lot of neat characters, a actually. Lot. Yeah, they have the whole village. Yeah. It's a cute one, too. Oh, wow. <laughs> uh. Yeah, dude, she is speaking. Looks he too healthy. Yeah. Older sister. Oh. Ooh. Oh, she oh, wants she... to take the sickness. Yeah, that's a good sister. Caring for her. Wow, every single day. <laughs> no, she just looks at it as her daily training. <gasps> oh, saved her. Oh. Senko doing the physical work for her. <laughs> yeah, I all. knew this was gonna happen. Yep. He's too He's... weak. Oh, here we go. Him and his experiment. Oh my god, they literally built like a car. <laughs> He's even drifting with this thing, dude. <laughs> like, they wow, made it. Here's the village. Oh, they have a star. Wow. It's like old and young. Oh, there's that little oh. berry guy. Yeah. 40 of them. Holy crap. <laughs> he must be the security. Yeah. Look at that. They got freaking like... All healthy... sorts of styles. Yeah, healthy women. Oh. oh. She's not allowed to bring anybody? Yeah, outsiders. Man, but not even other humans outside the village? Oh, so they're like criminals who's outside of the village. I see. Oh, oh, yeah. oh my gosh. Oh, <laughs> yeah. She must be of. super strong. Yeah, the whole village fears her. He's showing them bubbles. Oh, <laughs> oh yeah, they've never seen this before. <laughs> He's attacking us. <laughs> <laughs> they're like little kids, man. <laughs> <laughs> He's checking to see how advanced they are. So this is where it starts, right? <laughs> <laughs> what is this sorcery? What? Let Ooh, someone, someone else handle it. <laughs> That's a special for... technique. Yeah. Whoa. Who's this? Dude, this guy's like another Taiju. He's the smart genius sorcerer. Let's see him go one on one with Senku. Oh, so this guy knows his stuff too, you know? He yeah. is a sorcerer, yeah. Oh, going off for a challenge, huh? Oh, yeah. Oh, that's that must be the battleground right there for the fight. <laughs> He's so excited. <laughs> <laughs> like magicians fighting. Ah. <laughs> He's thinking literal sorcery. Rainbow Bray's gonna. <laughs> Wait, what? Oh my gosh. He's just changing the flames' colors. 
I don't even know how to do that though, but yeah. <laughs> Look at his face. <laughs> well, now you know. <laughs> no, yeah, now I know how to change colors of fire. <laughs> now it's hitting him. <laughs> oh yeah, that's from Fire Force when the when she changed color, the color. of the fires, oh, yeah. right? <laughs> he thought changing it would make him bow down to him yeah. and run. Oh, this is his hut. Oh, I want to see what he's been making up. <laughs> this guy is so funny. <laughs> oh, <laughs> the static. <laughs> oh, a sulfur ball generator. Oh, 17th century invention. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> oh my <laughs> gosh, look at all of them. Yeah. Oh, is he going to take this over? No, he's actually impressed that he, even Built though this? he's like so many thousand years ahead, he's like another Senku, I think. That's true, yeah. He's so into sorcery. Yeah. He doesn't know that everything he's doing is science. really science. Yeah. Even if you reset science, there's always someone to pick it up. Yes. <laughs> Calling this kid an idiot. <laughs> Damn, that's crazy. It's just like human nature to technologically advance. You yeah. Know, no matter who it is. Oh my god, that's right. He's going to become a target to Tsukasa now. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Look at him. He loves it. <laughs> All of them are going to think Senku's crazy. Oh, he's going to get... Including the shed. Oh my god, Senku's going to get it all. Arithmetic. Uh-oh, yeah. Senku's Sen super... <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> See? He yeah. took it. Wow, these are all the stuff probably Senku didn't even find too. <laughs> Dude, these guys could be like best friends. Now Chrome can collect all this stuff for him. Right. Well, he does all you the got science. the manpower. And then Senku can teach him everything. <laughs> I used to collect bugs. I did too. <laughs> oh, they're gonna find out what these rocks can do. Ooh, Dragon Quest. Did they really bring that bring up? Bring Dragon Quest up? Yeah. Oh shoot! Everybody loves Dragon Quest, huh? Wow, what is he doing to the? Oh, whoa! Ooh. Shiny golden spear. Ah, so he made a custom just for him. Golden hmm. spear. <laughs> he uh. loves it. <laughs> yep, he secretly down inside loves it, right? Oh, Monster Hunter too. He's bringing up all what? sorts of he's, games. Yeah, he's bringing up everything. Dude, Senku freaking gamer, mm -hmm. right? Yeah. He's trying to heal someone? Oh, it's all for Ruri. Is Ruri the sister? Yeah. Wow, look at her. She's Whoa. like sitting on a throne. She, she must be the princess here. She looks so alike. Koaku. Yeah. Exactly like her. Oh, she's, oh, she's a, a priestess. priestess. <laughs> she's mm. so, so worried about the hair. Oh, man. She's oh. super sick. Senku should be the one that should be... That heal could be, her. That could heal her. Yeah, we don't even know what's wrong with her. Oh, he's gonna tell him about his world. Oh, yes. Yeah. He would not believe there's transportation, there's buses, there's planes, Wi Fi, tablets, iPads. Man, this guy's probably thinking, like, well, yeah, you've been <laughs> off to space? Like, what? Yeah, this is his uh, apprentice. Oh, is he's he crying? crying. Yeah, he's crying. He's probably so sad or he's crying because he's not able to see those. Oh, no, he's just so angry. About what happened. That how they could have lost everything. How people can work so hard to, you know, build all this advanced technology and just be wiped in a second. Mm -hmm. Ah, Senku's here. In his yeah, brain. Yeah, yep, yep, right in his brain. Senku's like the walking USB, right? Yes. <laughs> With all the information in there. <laughs> huh, if there's a word science in there, of course he can deal with it. Yeah. Antibiotics. Oh, they're making antibiotics. Wait, Senku's this skill too? What? Yeah, he's a scientist and a pharmacist. Oh my <laughs> right? god, an engineer. He fits perfectly with Senku. It's like if Senku was born after the purification, uh, the stone one, then that would be him. 
Yeah, that would be him. Kind of. Well, I mean, their personalities are like super different, but you know. Yeah, whereas uh, Senku, he wanted to go to space, go to the moon. Uh, this kid, he just likes to collect stuff and do sorcery. Think sorcery. Yeah, and yeah. his main motivation is to self Rui too. Mm -hmm. And that's really interesting how they said that, you know, no matter what, these shiny monkeys, you can put them in any planet you want, anywhere you want, right? And these guys will evolve and advance the technology. It's just, it's just human nature. Yeah, human na nature, curiosity. Curiosity. Yeah, I think it's the curiosity. Rui, she's a priestess. The older sister. Yes, she's a princess. And she looks Pri exactly... Priestess, priestess. Priestess, I'm sorry. And she looks exactly like Kohaku. Yeah, she looks exactly like Kohaku. Just different hairstyle. Mm -hmm. I wonder what the priestess does in this village. I wonder why she's been named that, but... She's, the priestess yeah but look, she has her own little area way high up in the pedestal probably something with spirits or something oh well, maybe right it's so funny how this guy he uh chrome he kind of looks like taiji too right yeah he He's does like taiji's little younger brother yeah it's like taiji's younger brother had the brains and taiji had the muscles yeah he looks like him or he could look like senku with brown hair yeah no nah, i don't think so they're just both like totally different swag true their yeah. swag the is so different, different. yeah yeah, okay, the personality just... personality is like tight. Also, another thing that they mentioned in this episode is that the person that that came from the Stone Age or whatever, not came from the Stone Age but broke free, um, hasn't told them about this because they're just learning about it because of Senku. Right, they're just like hiding the past. Yeah, it's, they're hiding the past and they're not letting anybody from the past in. You remember, they're guarding it off saying that they're um, bad people. Right, right. So it's like they're don't want them to learn about the history of humanity. Yes, yeah, so it's kind of like Tsukasa, right? Probably. It's like Someone Tsukasa. with like Tsukasa's mentality? Yeah. He wants to it, start all over? Yeah, that's what it sounds like. Oh, somebody did get kicked out of the village. Oh. Uh-oh. Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh, so that's his own daughter. Yep, the, the hair color. Oh my gosh. Damn, they got a healer fast. Yeah. It's not looking good. Huh. <laughs> <laughs> Hooray for science! Now everyone's gonna love science and him. Oh. <laughs> he sees, he sees through, through. Man, you think Senku can really pull this off? Antibiotics? But Damn. He has, yeah, I was about to say, how does he even know what way to treat her? Mushroom fungi, right? Penicillin. Right, are you taking notes? Yeah, I didn't know you can make it from rocks too. Oh, it's green mold penicillin. I thought it was mushrooms. <laughs> <laughs> well, Anna, the draw 10 billion percent. We're scientists. Holy cow, Whoa. he just made a whole presentation. Yeah, he did. <laughs> I like the way he says it warp right through it, right through the future. Warp through history. Oh my gosh, that's uh, okay, that's a lot. I saw vinegar, alcohol, sulfate. Man, he's gotta get all of that. That's yeah. insane. <laughs> Dude, look at that. That's cool. They made his hut into like his... Th it's probably the school. Oh, he just told learning. him that. Yeah, the earth orbits around. Yes. I think Senko's getting tired of teaching. The earth axis is shifting. That's right. It's been oh. so many years. So the North Star is not completely north right now. Ooh. Yeah, because it's tilting, right? And that's why he got lost. He was confused, yeah. yeah. S did Senku just learn something from them? He what? did. <laughs> What's wrong with his face? Come yeah, on. I want to know how these guys know about the true north. Oh, did he find a magnetic rock? The compass. Ah, it's like a compass. Whoa. <laughs> if they have wow. magnets, then what? No, oh, they're finding a big chunk yeah. of it. Whoa. Wait, so magnets are found in like in the river or something? I guess. <laughs> we have a fruit brute strength gorilla. He's calling her a gorilla too. Oh my gosh, <laughs> look at how much she pounded him. Oh, oh it's the baby go uh, the, the melon dude. Yeah, the great watermelon dude. Suika. It's Suika? a girl? I don't even think Suika. Oh yeah, it's a girl. But she doesn't I don't think she talks. Why is this guy so oh, mean to her? Oh, yeah. Oh, no, she does talk. <laughs> She's so cute. 
Yeah, uh, welcome, uh, watermelon girl. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> right? That's true. He doesn't care. Just as long as he can do what he can do. <laughs> yeah, how does he know Momotaro? Momotaro-san, Momotaro-san. Well, you see, now they know. So the Hold sister on. knew about it? I don't know it. Yeah. So Ludina is the one that knows all the history and probably tells him the story. Is that why she's the priestess? priestess. Is she the originator? Yeah, they, they now she's became high profile to him. Yeah. He has to cure her no matter what. Oh, Chrome, Chrome has a crush on Ludina. Of course. This has like a very... Beachy. Beachy. Yeah. Island. Island. Oh, they can't get anything hotter than fire. How are they gonna do it? Oh, just making one of these, uh, whatever you play, Stone. make on Minecraft too. Oh my gosh! <laughs> Look at him. Him. <laughs> it looks like he's dying. All of them are dying. <laughs> <laughs> she can't do she it. She fainted. <laughs> <laughs> this is so funny. Yeah, you guys go over there and help them, man. They need yes. more manpower. <laughs> That's like his baby now. Are they still going? Oh my nope. god, they all fainted. No, it's still sand. They're gonna use this guy next? Yep. <laughs> <laughs> They're gonna bait him. Oh my gosh. Oh, so he's going to gift them with a technology little gift. Whoa. Oh, wow. She actually literally turned into a watermelon. That's pretty cool. <laughs> she became a detective. Suika. Oh, there <laughs> she a, is. Yeah, spying. Oh, my gosh, dude. Ooh. Everybody wants to oh kill her. Oh, my gosh. She's <laughs> in the wrong yeah, spot. She, <laughs> what is going on in here? Where are these girls coming from? Oh, so he would just get him different fish or yes. different kind of food. Different type of food. They just want men. <laughs> <laughs> Something we can make. I don't know if you can make. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> right? They can't. <laughs> that girl must be the gold digger. <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> he thinks so. Oh. has a gorilla. Oh my god, he's on his knees. <laughs> oh, get him some nice fresh pork bacon. He'll love it. Or salt. Oh yeah, salt, right? Seasoning. That is a good way. Oh, glutamic acid and ion. Maybe make soy sauce or something. I don't know. Oh, they have a dog. Doctor Millet. Oh, I know these. Oh yeah. You know those? Uh huh. Yeah. What the hell? This guy's a chef too. He's gonna make food with that. Ah, <laughs> just freaking hold attack Zelda. Yo. What is he gonna? It's probably have to do with something with seasoning. Maybe I don't know. You can even eat that. Oh, it's a grain. Oh, it's grain. That's that's grain. So that's rice. Not rice. Not rice. Yeah, flour. flour. So I was about to say grain. Dude, this guy's literally making fried rice. I mean, no, this flour, right? Fried fish. Chicken. Wow, Whoa. they're just throwing everything in there. Ramen. ramen. Whoa, ramen. Did, did, what? This guy just freaking made ramen? Dang, they're going to get spoiled. Oh, he's gonna love this. Close mm -hmm. rip off. <laughs> this fool really, really made ramen. <laughs> wow, yeah. They can't stop eating it. What can this guy not do? Oh, no, oh. it wasn't good? No, it's not good for him. <laughs> if you think <laughs> of it as a medicine, but these guys love it. They love it because they've never had actual ramen. And this is how he can win the village over for, through ramen. If you can win a god of destruction over with ramen, you can win a village over with ramen. <laughs> Look at that. Like, it's like the food. <laughs> they yeah, literally a ramen stop. He does yeah, look he evil. He does look evil. What the freaks? Senko can cook too. Yeah. He he does really good improv. Improving. Well, I mean, I guess food is science. It right? is. It is science if mm -hmm. you think about it. Yeah. It's about what you put in and mix in and that makes the flavor good. Yes. So would that mean chefs are scientists? But their specialty is in the food. Food scientists. Mm-hmm. Right?
because they know like all the vitamins nutrition and all that stuff that goes in it as well too of course we should have thought that it should have been a bowl of ramen mm. right coming from senku and it's like a, they're from japan culture so it's like well i thought maybe the fried would have been good but then they oh, don't for have fried oil fish. they don't have oil yeah, yeah that's right so i was not thinking anything about ramen mm -mm. now thinking about it i should have because i mean it's easy to cook mm -hmm. you just need a broth good broth and good noodles and that's it yeah i thought they were just gonna do maybe fish and bread or something because no that, that guy's been, grain. Dude, that guy's been eating fish all his life i i, I was thinking they were gonna give him like bacon you know bacon dude i mean you give someone that has never touched bacon in his whole life that's where they could get oil from because you remember they were cutting that boar boar is yeah, like a pig they have oil yeah they do i also love the fact that every single episode we see this face of senku every episode you see like a troll face of senku and uh, yeah right every single episode ruri she knows about some stuff about the world yeah and i think that's why she's like the high priestess because she has knowledge she has right. intel they accepted her in the village accepted her in mm -hmm. even though she wasn't of the what was she not i don't know i actually have no idea i have no idea good thing that senku found out so he's taken a high interest in her and then that must mean he's taken a high interest in the dad too because you remember when they said the backstory like she was a baby and so that's why she's like a new blood, kind of like she doesn't know anything. She's learning from the elders because she didn't know anything because she was a baby. Right. So she came back Stone Age. Um, during the Stone Age, she must have been cracked open somehow. And when they were babies? Yeah, when they were babies. Some, something like that. So maybe it's the dad. Maybe the dad and the sister remember stuff. No, I don't think... Because it looks like the dad's the chief. Unless the dad is the one that taught Ruri all those stuff. And Ruri tells everybody else. So you think that that family is part of the modern world, the past? Yes. And they got purified? Yes. Petrified? Petrified. Yes. Okay. Well, then what do you think of the melon girl? That's cute. Yeah, she's cute. It's yeah. funny how she can just turn into a watermelon. I was always wondering what the heck that was, but it was a watermelon. Cool. All right, guys. That was Dr. Stone episode 7 and 8. Thank you guys so much. We'll see you guys next week for Dr. Stone episode 9. Stay awesome. Have a great day, and we'll see you next time, guys. Yes, we'll see you guys next time. Bye. Bye.